Guys, Tyler Breeze has been unsuccessfully trying to eliminate Otis for quite a while now. He's going to need a lot more stakes and lift a lot more weights if he wants to throw Otis over the top rope. Adam Cole from behind, and he eliminates both of them. And now Adam Cole is all alone. Oh, and baby. To catch his breath before the next superstar enters. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. It's Sincala. It's Sincala, Michael. It's not the body. Oh no! His trampoline exploded. Is he okay? Considering he just hit the apron and rid first at full speed, I'm gonna go with no. No, no. Unfortunately, it looks like Sin Cara will not be able no, to no, no, the no, no, Sin Cara is bye bye. Who would think the undefeated era would be around at this time? Bye bye. I guess we're moving on to our next entry. On me. Yeah, the long hair's gone because it's serious time now. I gotta get the title back. <laughs> oh. Oh. Win the rumble by eliminating everyone. Okay, let's do this. I've heard the rumble has been a is a bit. So let's see how much of a bitch it is. Out you go, Adam. Do 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 do. Alright, eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, do the two step, one, it's the Monday Night Messiah, Chef Lawrence. Ooh, come on, Chef. You won the lump, wait, has Chef won the lump? I don't remember. And no, you don't, Chef. Uh oh, get ready! Poison Rana! Who's next? Nasty, so precise. His offense is on point right now. It's time to walk with the jobber. Come on, Chef. Use your reversal stock or let Elias deal with you. Or Elias gonna go after me like a dingus. Have to touch the floor once you go over the top rope in order to be eliminated. Oh yeah, I have to do Guys, something that I completely remember now. Match without mentioning the mastermind behind the epic event. Of course, that person is WWE Hall of Famer Elias, a true legend. Boy, the time just flies, Oh, see it. New day. New day. Snap suplex. Back inside the ring. Ah. Uh, okay, you really? Watch this. Ooh, bullseye. We're moments away from yet another gladiator entering the ring. Okay, it didn't give me my move. Okay, we should give me that one. Okay. And now, Elias, it's time for you to feast your eyes. OMG. Oh, coast to coast. In the middle of the Royal Rumble. Okay. Daniel Bryan, Daniel Bryan, Daniel Bryan, Daniel Bryan. Daniel Bryan, Daniel Bryan, Daniel Bryan, Daniel Bryan. Imagine pitching a battle royal. 
that starts with just two people. On paper, that's a tough Oh, no, Daniel. Patterson, you have to trust that he knows what he's doing. Oh, good. Expecting that. Over the top, maybe. There may be no fighting free from this. Oh, face. Look out, a possible elimination coming up. And Big E exploiting the opening. Oh, dude, got a little free perk in elimination that women. Daniel, you idiot! Seth Rollins gets out of trouble. And quickly. No, Big E. Think about what you're doing. Remember the best of seven? Saw what he had in mind there. Well scouted reversal there. Oh. Okay, while well, we're still targeting Velveteen, the game just screwed me. The game really just screwed me. What the? The game is screwing me. Oh, of course he reverses. Okay, there, don't give me my payback. I'm being out of the game! Don't give me anything because you want to screw me over! Oh my god! Finally! Okay, Chef, meet the Harbinger knee. Okay, Lucky Say. Get out. He's looking to fly. There are all sorts of things he can do to an opponent after a takedown like that. <laughs> I'll take out Chef. So we actually have a newcomer. Oh, of course. Of course. And of course it didn't give me my payback. Cause why would it? Oh, thank goodness. Yes, yeah, Chef, take out Ricochet. I mean, Velveteen. Or not. Oh my god! What was that game? Boom! But are we actually gonna do this? Of course not! Cause the game automatically makes them good at countering when you're trying to win. But I'm good at countering too. They can't, he can't reverse. Get out. Yes, yes, yes. Fuck. And I've won the rumble. Yes, yes, yes. Wait. What? What? Is that what I think it is? No way. Hey, Tito Shall Tilly. 
Wait. It's the rock! It's the rock who's the president! <laughs> We're all witnessing history for the first time ever. The president is competing in the Royal Rumble, and Trey has to beat him. Oh God! Imagine if the Rock did Rock wins this. The pissed off how he pissed off he would be, and how stupid the political talk would be about it. The economy is in a downstairs, and The Rock, our president, is competing at WrestleMania. Dwayne, come on, Dwayne, come on, Dwayne. <laughs> uh, okay, you're bigger than I remember. Kaboom! When the Royal Rumble by eliminating the Lock. Okay, this is. If we think it'd be a finisher. I think I should have had Royal Rumble finisher by now. Okay. Oh my god, he instantly recovered. Uppercut! Oh, he's not gonna use his reverse. Yes! Belly to belly! Oh. Rock just got out of the way. So Damn it. Oh. Wow, well, that's your, they moved your back. They don't give you a payback. And He's nope. Step ahead there. Great technical no on display. <laughs> Come on, Dwayne. You fell for it, Dwayne. Face a mic check, Dwayne. Come on, Dwayne, you show that reversal. You know you want to. <laughs> and the suplex. Turning the momentum to his favor. When this guy's on, look out. And out you go. Aren't any more surprises this time? It's official. Trey has won the Royal Rumble. Come at me, and you'll see. I more than meet the eye. I beat the president. It looks like the president's not finished with Trey. Oh, Dwayne. Trey has earned the president's seal of approval. <laughs> Maybe he's in line for a cabinet position. Let's not get carried away, Saxon. Yeah. God damn. It could go for one fall, one fall, and then for the WWE. Divas Championship for some goddamn reason in 
big time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael. And judging from the response on social media heading into this match, we're likely to see a new champ crown here tonight. A big opportunity for her here, Corey, as the gold could be going home with her tonight. I'm going to go out on a limb here and say that tonight is the night we crown a new champion. That's how impressed I've been by her lately. It's the woman who's made a living beating people up, Brooklyn Von Braun. Champ comes into his title defense incredibly confident, Corey. And with good reason, Cole. When you're the champ, you don't have to worry about winning. You just have to make sure you don't lose. That is the champion's advantage. That entrance might work with some more of my characters I'm working on. Introducing the challenger from Austin, Texas, Barbara. Yeah. And introducing the champion, she is the WWE Diva Champion. champion. The historic Divas title may have a new owner tonight. Why are we fighting for the butterfly belt? Only a WWE fan who grew up in 2010 watching would want this. Oh, wait. <laughs> and there's Greg, the referee, finally working for WWE after years of ISW abuse. The match with and here we go. Get Brooklyn to yellow health. That's not how you get her to yell out. They tell you, bum at me, and you'll see I'm more than me. The eye. Hello there, my enemy. Welcome to my punching foot out. No. WWE has been virtually seamless. Yeah, it's very similar to how quickly Ronda Rousey covered by the champ. Already? No, 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 Brooklyn. Oh. I know how to do walking holds. I played this game since 2004. <laughs> Kabam! And the drop kick. Drop kick. Straight punch. Ooh. Oh, what a punch. That's how you Here we go. And the neck break. So smooth. She steers clear there. Boop. Bop. No, 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 no. Oh! Spear out of nowhere! Ed wants his gimmick back. <laughs> and no, you don't. Fisherman! Buster! Gonna put you to sleep. She still has a lot of time to recover, though. Okay, and the next bop should put her in. Cause the kick and uh whoop bump. Oh, I'm gonna strike on Brooklyn in the ring. Okay, Brooklyn, let's do the two step with this hair grip. Look at this dynamic bones. Whoever did this dynamic bones, the good with the colliders, but not the kabop. Bang, bop, and bang. The yang and bang combo. And it's Pierre! Both women are down. So far, these two have been matching each other move for move. One of them needs to somehow gain an inch. Oh, that clipping. And there you see Samoa Joe watching this heated battle. Hmm. 
I think he's headed out here to provide that edge Brooklyn needs. Trey nails him. No, you don't. He was ready to stop him. These two need to think of the long. Can you finish on Samoa Joe in the parking lot? Oh, it already has a finisher. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do
to give Yang the, Yang the bop and bang and call it the bop and yang. <laughs> and the boop. Pick up. And it's time to send you out. Willy Yang. One, two, three. <laughs> He's the only woman in history to hold the WWE Divas and SmackDown Women's title. <laughs> We're an overachiever. You here to demand your rematch? Because I have no problem beating you again tonight. There's not gonna be a rematch. You're giving up that easily? No, there's not going to be a rematch because you're going to announce your retirement tonight. What? <laughs> That's news to me. It's why I wanted to find you first thing. So you could start writing your big farewell speech. But that kind of emotional garbage should actually come easily to you. I mean, if you get stuck, you could just borrow something from your earlier writing. You've probably asked yourself a million times. Oh my God! He fe how did he kept that? Oh no. The truth is, we did, but we had to make the hardest decision of our lives because we didn't feel we could give you the life you deserved. Garbage, garbage, garbage. Fuck you. Love you. always. Poorly your mom written, and bitch. Dad. That's right. I found out you wrote that little piece of fiction, kicking off twenty years of lies to your best friend. His real parents are dead. And you've been stringing him along this entire time, making him think they're alive just so you'd have one friend in your depressing life? You never told him the truth, even when he continued to pathetically leave two empty seats for them that would never be filled. Why? Why are you doing this? The why doesn't really matter. Right now, you should be more concerned with the what, as in what could happen next. I could expose you and all your lies, destroying your life, your reputation, and most of all, your friendship with Trey. Or, you can retire immediately, and I'll make your secret my secret. But one way or another, it's happening tonight. I know walking away from everything you've worked for will be the hardest thing you've ever done, but you have to keep our secret. Please. <gasps> Mm, no. Mm -hmm. And that's how I won the WWE Divas Championship, crossing off one of the most Look, elusive so things on the list. I, but the Divas open. Championship that's wasn't them. just a title. That's my mom and dad. It was more than that. It was. Uh, uh, sorry, I, I think something. Oh no! Happened. No! What Today did Brooklyn do? Oh my oh, God! Fame ceremony tonight, and I, I mm. think they just arrived. I don't know I, what's I, happening I either. I'm a little distracted. Who are those people? This is bad. That's putting it lightly. This is... We're almost done here, so I'll catch up with you real soon, okay? Oh my god. Uh, sorry, again, for cutting you off. Where were you? There's really not much left to say. Other than to cover how we ended up here tonight. When I defeated my lifelong nemesis to capture this championship, the same championship I dreamed of winning as a young girl, it was an amazing feeling. Even knowing it's crippling through the jacket in my hair. I was consumed by a range of different emotions, ones that I hadn't felt in a very long time. Satisfaction, relief, peace of mind, the fire, that drove me throughout my career to come out here and fight on a nightly basis was suddenly gone. I went from thinking, what's next? To what's left? And I realized that after crossing off the most elusive item on the list, the answer was not much. Because I accomplished everything I set out to do, and way more. 
So I had to be honest with myself. If I kept going, everything after would feel like a letdown. And that's not how I want to live my life or remember my career. So with all that being said, I'm here tonight to relinquish the Divas Championship and announce my retirement from WWE effective immediately. Is this actually happening? Unfortunately, I, I think it is. Now, I know this is probably shocking and some of you might be disappointed or upset, but this isn't necessarily a bad thing. I've lived this part of my life to the fullest and now it's time for me to go explore other challenges. And who knows? Maybe I'll try acting again. You all saw how my only other audition went. Can't go worse than that, right? <laughs> Finally, mm. I just want to say thank you. Thank you for supporting me for all these years. This is the most sincere she sounded in the whole game. The next women who take my place, who I am certain will be stronger, more athletic, and hopefully a little less temperamental than I was. <clears throat> so, yeah, that's it. Thanks, everyone. really sure what to say. I'm stunned. I think we all are. No one was expecting this. Uh, thank you, Red. Yes, thank you. And we wish you all the best. Thank you, Red. Thank you, Red. Thank you, Red. What was that? You can't retire. You've got years left on your career. I'm sorry, but I need you to try to understand. Maybe I could wrap my head around it if I had a little more warning. I mean, when you texted me, make sure you watch my promo tonight, I was expecting you had some clever line about Brooklyn, not that you were going to walk away from WWE. This wasn't something I was planning for a long time. It happened quickly. Okay, fine. But if you're done, then I'm done. We're a package deal, remember? No, what? Don't do this. I need you to try to understand. What about the title shot you just earned in the Royal Rumble? I'm getting revenge on Samoa Joe for everything he's done. None of that matters if you're not along for the ride, too. You need to think about this some more. You're making an impulsive decision. I've made up my mind. I'm done. I never expected my plan to work this well and cause your idiot friend to retire too. It's like getting rid of two turds with one stone. This isn't over. But it is over. And that's the best part of all of this. Anyway, just wanted to wish you a happy early retirement. Maybe you can take up bingo or going to dinner at 3 p.m. or yelling at kids in your neighborhood. If you kick that ball in my yard one more time, I'm going to put you on my list. <laughs> Hilarious. See you, uh, never again. We're going live with your show intro in five minutes. Thanks. Uh, just let me run through it once to make sure I've got it. <clears throat> Who will be named as your top ten? Prepare yourself. Oh my god, he actually did it. Get their hands dirty. Glad handing with the CEO of a manure company to see who can get the upper hand for their fall fertilizer campaign. It's all hands on deck. Coming up next on America's Next Top Hand Model. Do you think there's too many hand puns? It's perfect. It's not heavy-handed at all. <laughs> I see what you did there. <laughs> hey, hey, sorry I missed your other call. I'm at my new hosting gig. Look, if this is about getting Baron Corbin a spot on the show, I'm still relatively <laughs> new here, so I don't think I have that kind of pull yet. Oh, 
Okay, good, because honestly, I don't think Baron's hands are anything to write home about. <laughs> Wait, what'd you say? Really? That, that's amazing! Did you tell Red yet? Yeah, she's been hard to reach lately. Okay, I'll, I'll try her. This is truly an honor. Thank you so much. I'm gonna be famous, or I'm gonna be famous. Oh my god, he's doing this stupid dance again. No. That's my ring. And my championship. I hate you, Brooklyn. Ah, oh, but he's volume 4 mode. What? Hey, it's been a while. How's it going? I'm great. I'm on vacation at the beach, which is why no one's been able to reach me. I'm trying to disconnect, you know? Oh, that's good to hear. I only have a minute, so I'll make this quick. I just got some amazing news. We're going into the WWE Hall of Fame together. Really? Wow, I I'm shocked. I mean, I thought it would happen someday, but definitely not this fast. They didn't say this, but I'm assuming they want to capitalize on my crossover appeal as host of ANTHM. I'm sure that's it. <coughs> I know we didn't expect our careers to end the way they did, but it's nice to know we accomplished enough to go into the Hall of Fame. And more importantly, we're going in together, just like it's always been. Yeah, it is nice. Hey, I gotta run. Don't relax too much. You know what they say about idle hands. Ooh, I gotta work that into tonight's show. Congrats. You too. Ooh, I wish I could see Brooklyn's reaction. <laughs> I'm sure she won't be happy. Which makes me happy. <laughs> <laughs> Move! Don't look at me, don't look at me, get out of my way! <sighs> are you kidding me? Those two pieces of human trash are going into the Hall of Fame? This has to be a joke! They were only in the WWE for a cup of coffee. You know what? An actual cup of coffee deserves to be inducted before they do! Ah! Take it easy. We're all entitled to our opinions, but there are certain realities you can't dispute. While Red and Trey may have had shorter careers than the typical Hall of Famer, the impact they made during that time was tremendous. So it doesn't matter if you or anyone else disagrees, they are going to get the recognition they deserve. With my poly in the face, you know, beard. Feels like we've been up here for like 15 hours. Hope everyone's still with us. But uh, I think that pretty much sums everything up, right? Yeah. 15 hours feels yeah, like all. the average way for the campaign. There's only one thing left to do. List, please. <laughs> it's time to cross off one final list item together. Get inducted into the WWE Hall of Fame. Shoot, I think I forgot a pen. Seriously? I've got one you can use. I I'm sure someone else in this arena has a spare pen, so you can go sit down. Take it easy. I just wanted to come up here in front of the world to say congratulations and finally put our differences behind us. I would never do anything to take away from your special night that you so rightfully deserve. <sighs> Trey, even your birth parents are here, which is amazing. Stand up, please. Oh my god. Before you this finish up, is there's just uh... one left out of your speech. You see, Red wasn't 100% honest about what led to her retirement Brooklyn. from her best friends. In fact, it turns out she has a little secret, which is the real reason she walked away from WWE. You have to do something. She's going to ruin everything. I'm sorry, but I'm done hiding this for us. It's over. What? What happened was I found out the truth behind this secret, and she didn't want me to tell anyone. So she chose to retire instead. But I couldn't sit back and let her get away without everyone knowing the real Red. So let's start with this. That lovely older couple in the audience, they're not Trey's parents. I know, because they're fakes I hired to be here. That letter you got that said they were coming tonight, also a fake. But if you want to see your real oh, God, I can make that happen. Here they are. Yeah, that pretty much says it all. And look at the date there. They were already long gone by the time we were in high school. Which makes you wonder, Trey. 
How could they have written you a letter? Maybe someone else wrote it to try to manipulate you into doing whatever they wanted. And maybe that person was so miserable and lonely, they had to resort to something morbid like that to ensure they always had a friend at their side. But who would do such a terrible thing? Certainly not your so-called best friend, right? Is this true? We're not finished here. Uh. If you come any closer, I will crush his neck. And the same goes for anyone else. If you try to stop us, I what? will end him. The book and the yell help us stay away from Shamar Jow. The fat ass. I Brooklyn tumble you to pay for everything. Boom. You really thought this was gonna go will end well for you, Brooklyn? Oh. No. You bit. What? What was that animation? No. <laughs> oh my god, what the? Give me a counter game. Give me a counter. What did this? Yeah, I'm hitting. I'm hitting it when you tell me to. Okay. Fuck you, game. Fuck you, Brooklyn. What? Real ripper. Are we just gonna fight everyone from our library so what next, Becky Lynch? <laughs> but wait, is this NXT washout? <gasps> she just screwed herself. Yep, there's Becky. Okay, Bex. <laughs> Time for you to die. Die! Did she just... Okay. I mean, this is one with it in the Hall of Fame. So, I mean, who else went in there with us this year? <laughs> wow, that was easy. <laughs> And the book gun. Why would Brooklyn and Becky work together? Okay, Red would definitely be di not injured from that. But Trey, Trey's fucking dead. another ice machine run you know there's some wounds that ice can't heal 
<laughs> what? You, you have to admit, that was a pretty cheesy line. <laughs> you know, you have a really strange way of apologizing. I'm sorry. It's just, we've been working through this all night, and I think I'm starting to lose it. <laughs> Look, you know how I truly feel. You also know me better than anyone else. I made a stupid decision to protect you when we were kids, and it just kept escalating from there. I wanted to tell oh you my so God, this many is getting times. Bad. Harder and harder, especially when you started leaving the tickets. Uh, I just see. myself to take that away from you. It would be like you finding out that America's Next Top hand model was fixed. Wait, is it? Did you hear something? <laughs> no. I was just using that as an example. <sighs> okay. Because I don't think I could handle that right now. I think I always knew deep down that it was all too good to be true. That I'd never meet them. But I guess a part of me wanted to believe that maybe something bigger would come out of all of this. That it wasn't just about action figures or championships or entertaining millions of people. That it would help me find a part of myself that was missing. But maybe something bigger did come out of all this. This wasn't about finding two people who would fill a hole in your life. It was about millions of people finding you to fill holes in their lives. <laughs> <laughs> now that was cheesy. <laughs> but it's uh, true. <laughs> oh my god. I have something for you. Please don't tell me this is a letter from my long-lost aunt and uncle telling me to forgive my best friend. Just open it. <laughs> What's this all about? It's our new list. On one of my ice machine runs, or maybe it was one of the times you locked me out of the room, I can't remember, but... I made some phone calls to management, and it's unprecedented, but they've agreed to let us get revenge on Brooklyn and Samoa Joe at tomorrow night's WrestleMania. Nice. I guess we're coming out of retirement. This has to be some kind of record. <laughs> There's one other thing mm. you need to know. Brooklyn and Samoa Joe agreed to the match, but only if we put our Hall of Fame spots on the line. What? You really want to do this? That is if you don't fight back is after what they stupid. did, then we don't deserve those spots. <laughs> package deal I'm in <laughs> hey just wanted to let you know I left two open seats in the audience just like you always did why I mean obviously my birth parents aren't showing up anytime soon so was it just for good luck or out of respect or something you'll see 